Hey guys, today we're going to do a quick unboxing of Maytech uh, Anti-Spark Switch. Um, so this basically protects, uh, I would use it for bypassing DMS. Um, so one of the biggest problems I've, I've seen with uh, commercial products is that sometimes I'll take it up this hills. And you know, I live right by San Francisco, so the hills are just, just massively steep out here and uh, i know most of you are probably going to be riding in flat ground or maybe just slight steep uh, slight hills um so if you want to uh what, what's what's really happens is sometimes on a board that's not designed for hills um basically i'll go up a hill and the battery bms will cut off and this is one of the worst things that can happen on a skateboard it ha it's happened with my cheaper chinese skateboard i'm not going to name who cool because you know I'm trying to work actually work with the companies to fix it um, so when you use cheaper batteries anything less than like a 30Q 18650 uh, you have a chance of the BMS cutting off so the DIY skateboarders what we can do to pr protect against you know your board completely stopping the BMS cutting off because if the VS cut it off it won't actually stop the motor it will actually let the motor go um, but it will slowly slow down. But if you let the BMS cut the voltage, basically, if you're using a belt motor, it's going to lock up and you're going to fly off your board. So for DIYers, I totally recommend using a BM, uh, BMS bypass. So basically, for the positive negative terminal, terminal to your skateboard, you just basically go off the main terminals of your battery pack. Right, instead of going through the BMS because if you go through the BMS for example a lot of BMS's are rated for 30 40 50 amps um, if the manufacturers you know use a huge BMS but then if you use like a hundred amp BMS 200 amp BMS your BMS becomes huge right and then it just unnecessary to do that so the better way is to bypass BMS and if something shorts what you do is um, you put a anti uh, spark switch this is also like a fuse this is rated for 180 uh, amps so what you do is after you uh, bypass the bms before you connect it to your skateboard let's say up here you connect this to the battery and this acts as a sa safety uh, 180 amps um, fuse so if you're a board somehow you, you know if you're getting a crash or something or if you uh, if your board somehow shorts maybe too much humidity I don't know, maybe some kind of piece of metal can get into your battery box somehow. Whatever it is, um, this will stop uh, the spark from causing fire to the battery pack. So this will save your battery pack. Um, this will prevent fires. So if you do bypass BMS, you'll always want to use an anti-spark uh, switch. And this will also act as your switch that you can turn on easy on and off. So I just wanted to tell you guys how you can build a safer skateboard um, bypassing the BMS I would totally recommend because it just keeps your skateboard safer and also you can use an anti-spark spark switch to keep your battery safe All right.